At the Monterey Bay Half Marathon, California's scenic coast is on full display. But for two men running this past November, the event became a race to save their lives. Engine 12, medical emergency, 169 Ocean View Boulevard. Just three miles in, 67-year-old Greg Gonzalez collapsed without warning. Luckily, running behind him was cardiologist Stephen Loam. He had no pulse. He wasn't breathing. This is a runner from the marathon who was running and fell, and it looks like there's CPR in progress. Dr. Loam administered chest compressions until paramedics arrived with a defibrillator, jump-starting Greg's heart and transporting him to a nearby hospital. Knowing Greg was in good hands, Dr. Loam decided he would finish the race. Once you finally saw the finish line, it must have been a relief until... Well, yes, I crossed the finish line and then I heard somebody say, I think we need some help over here. And I looked over to the side and there was another runner down, laying on the ground. You not, have got not to moving. be kidding me. That's exactly what I thought for a brief moment. Cardiac arrest at the finish line. Hard to imagine, only two hours after performing CPR, Dr. Loam found himself on call once again as 56-year-old Michael Heileman went down just after finishing the race. He had a, a head wound completely unresponsive, not breathing, no pulse. So I just said, okay, let's do it again. In minutes, a race volunteer rushed a defibrillator to Michael's side, and Dr. Loam delivered a life-saving shock to his heart. So check this out. Greg and Michael, who both had heart attacks during the half marathon, have never met each other, and they haven't seen Dr. Loam since he saved both of their lives. It's all about to happen right now. Greg. So good to see you. I'm so glad you're doing well. We're alive. Yes, we made it. Now these two men, strangers to each other, were about to meet the doctor whose heroic actions hey. bonded them. Great to see you both. Great to see you. Guys you guys look great. Thank you so much Thank for you so much. saving course, our lives. Give me a hug, man. I see the tears oh, in your eyes right now. <laughs> How cool is this? Oh, it's the best ever. Second chance at life? Yeah. Best. Yeah. What is it like, Greg and Michael, for you to be here with Dr. Lum? This is a gift. Yeah, this is... <laughs> yes. It feels like crossing the finish line. I don't want to over-dramatize this, but the way the doctor described it to me is clinically you both... Is this right? That they both died? Well, you can essentially think of it that way. Without that intervention, yes, it would have been fatal. What's it like to hear that? It's giving me a second chance with my boys, and that's been the hardest part. <laughs> What's it like to see them now? Even better. It's wonderful. Are you a believer in miracles? Now, I think to some degree, yes. <laughs> I'm not I sure I was before, before, but, but um, I am now. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Total miracle. Perfect person at the perfect time in the perfect place. But wait, there's more. All three of them are planning to run the half marathon again wow. next year together. And Michael and Greg, they're already bouncing back. They're wa uh, walking multiple times a day. Dr. Loam wanted me to tell you guys this. He hopes this story encourages everybody to do their part to prevent heart attacks by maintaining a healthy diet and exercise and learn hands-only CPR. That's the heel of the hand in the center of the chest, pushing hard, fast, to the beat of... You guessed it, staying alive. Uh, and as Dr. Loam says, you do not have to be a cardiologist to save somebody's life. But That's boy. like a real miracle in Monterey. That is an incredible story. The fact that he was there made all the difference And in a the great world. tip, too, for anyone who happens to be around. I mean, if you're running and you're not a cardiologist, I mean, yeah. just, just to know those tips is life saving. You never know what's going to happen. It gives me the chills to tell the story and to have been there with those guys. And it was you could so special. feel the emotion yeah. in their voices. Yeah. Incredible, Jake. Glad they're all right. Jake, appreciate it. Thank yes, you so much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.